Here we are at uh, Dream Sports Center here in uh, Apex, North Carolina. I'm here with Mr. Bob, and Bob is an, an inventor, uh, but it, he loves kids more than anything, and he created something called the uh, Rebounder, the soccer ball rebounder and juggler. And he's here today to demonstrate how to use this juggler and uh, this rebounder, and I will say that this it's it's pretty amazing. Just stay tuned and check it out. Child to practice with this product 15 minutes a day, and they will do it regularly, and they really set their mind to it. Mm -hmm. that they will learn to manipulate the ball much, much better, and they will improve their skills. Outside, outside, off the knee, off the knee, off the knee, off the knee, two ways, two ways, inside, inside, two ways, two make a one size fits all belt hmm. that's what i did here okay and, uh, and that one size fits all belt because it goes around the waist and then they can adjust it to whatever their particular uh, habit so might be okay uh, that keeps them from tangling okay, okay. and it's also is, is hinged and then i also have a swivel on the other end so that you can spin the ball without the Mm. without the bungee cord Got nodding it. up. Excellent, excellent, and, uh, okay. okay. So you have two swivels. Just, uh, two for swivels. smaller kids, the tether is also adjustable. You can pinch the, the uh, button together and make the, the tether longer or shorter. Got it. Which is important for the younger kids because otherwise you're going to have a bunch of cord that they can't Got use. Got it. Ball back into play. Okay. And that's called a pump. And they can learn to pump the ball in two ways, outside, outside, off the knee, off the knee. Off the knee, off the knee, two ways, two ways, inside, inside, and move the ball forward by manipulating the ball with both feet. They can pass the ball, and they can trap it. Wow. I, I hear from parents and from coaches all the time that I can't, I give the kids my time, I give them all the drills that they need to do, but as I have very little control over keeping them keeping them into the loop and mm -hmm. for in order to get the biggest problem that I hear from kids and talking to them, why don't you practice regularly every day? And of course the answer that I get is, well I have to chase the ball. I spend up more time chasing the ball than I do kicking the ball. That's right. And right. I can't. It can be used for all types of kicks and return right back. The stretch at 125%. And as, since it's a single, partially made a single tether now, it has more buoyancy than it does if you're kicking two of them, two uh, layers of it. And I wanted to give them some additional practice capabilities because whenever the ball goes out of bounds, there's only one way to get it back in, and that's called a throw in. Right. And they can practice doing a throw in and the ball comes right back to them each and every time. Okay. So they, it's another <laughs> good feature. It gives them that extra practice and then they go right back to juggling again with the feet. 